Hello, 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 and welcome back, guys and girls, to some more Puzzle and Dragons Z on the Nintendo 3DS. Part 26 is here, up and running, and hopefully, you guys are excited for it because we are moving on to a brand new continent. This continent probably is going to resemble the element of fire. We'll see when we get there. Probably will be because we've actually done all the other four. But then again, um, Captain Retire was actually speaking of um, death orbs which Dogma is creating or something like that and it just sounds really really scary because Death Orb seems like if you make an orb of that type then it's going like, to mean like automatic death or something like that we're not really sure what to expect that expect yet they may actually come in the final continent which is the sixth one but I guess we'll just have to wait and see we'll see what this fifth continent is going to be all about hopefully not too punishing it's another five levels until we reach the, the final Sky Dragon and yeah I guess we'll just wait and see so we picked up one new monster which is now what did we pick up? We picked up something, I just can't remember what it was. I think it may have been this guy. A true dragon, he looks kind of cool I guess. Um, I'm going to work on boosting him because our dark type dragons kind of suck in a way. Mythic Dark Knight, okay that's what we actually picked up. So not this thing, but he's kind of cool, he's a twin headed dragon, he seems alright. Whoa, level 18 in one, cool. Great, and we'll give him this other egg and uh, hopefully we can get to at least level 25. No guarantees, but we'll see. Alright, level 20, not quite the 25, but not bad, we've got a defensive boost, and we'll leave it as that. So these type of monsters I'll probably just work, in, work on in my own time, and then hopefully have them ready for the last few battles. But what do we have here? Enigma and Dogma. Lord Dogma, I regret to inform you that Himaru has been defeated by Monkey. How has Monkey grown so powerful in such a short time? As you say, we cannot take Monkey lightly. Himaru was able to buy us some time though. For now, you have returned to your full strength, my lord. Surely no one will be able to inflict as much as a scratch on, on you in your current state. Forget Zed City, I will crush Monkey myself now. How dare they! Those humans, those pretty humans, or petty humans I should say, who do they think they are? Curse them all! Curse them! Without your royal powers, my lord, the destruction of Zed City would, would be possible, impossible. Damn it, what's going on with my vocab today? But I suggest we leave Monkey to our strongest one. Yes, yes, you're right. We still have a. How do you pronounce this, guys? Amy? I know it kind of like looks different. Amy would be A M Y. Ayami? Whatever, anyway. But it pains me not to end Monkey this very moment. The Temple of Life is our priority. Amy should finish off that imbecile in no time. What are you still doing here? Hurry up and get on with your job. My apologies, Lord Dogma. I will get back to manipulating Ark Velsa this very instant. Those blasted humans, I'll show him. Oh, finally got all the words out in the end. But yeah, moving on. Usually in the warehouse you get like um a few chests in there, but there's only three doors the first time round, so I'm not really gonna go and check there. Do you know what it's probably worth Is it worth a look? Unless it's like a long way round, but I don't really want to go there. Oh yeah, there's the warehouse, it's actually a long way round. Okay, it's not even that far. But um after the first three continents we completed. It did reward us with three sets of treasure chests. And it looks like that's going to be. Oh, that's kind of weird because you would expect there to be a fourth and a fifth one. But, um, never mind. I've always thought there was a shortcut there. I must have been dreaming all that time. Do I dream about puzzles and dragons? Probably not, but yeah. Anyway. Nevertheless, moving on to the fifth continent. First time here. First level. And we'll see how this goes. Alright, so obviously it's going to be based on light. Um, Heartless Dungeon. Oh god, Heartless Dungeon? I thought it meant like Heartless in No Forgiving. <laughs> it's gonna be the most punishing place. Well, I guess it is quite punishing because it's gonna be no restoring your health here. But the area boosts the highest altitude in Draco Maxia. The entire dragon, the higher region, is enveloped in a thick layer of ice. Alright, well, here we go. No Heart Dungeon. Mystic Ice. Ugh, this place is gonna be creepy. Okay, let's see what we can do here. Uh. I'm not even sure who we should take with us. I was thinking to take two fires, but now I'm thinking take two waters. Or maybe just create a new team, because we did actually unlock a seventh slot um, after that last continent, so I guess that's what we do now. Uh, yes. We was working on one new water type, but it's not actually currently ready yet. I mean, it's kind of ready, a Dragonoid 3-star. Uh, 
Changes wood orbs into water orbs does not affect Z orbs. Uh, raise the attack of your water monsters or divine type monsters slightly. Maybe we should consider. Yeah, we'll consider using that. And we'll throw in. Alright, 770 attack, and this one is definitely stronger. So we'll go with you also. We'll take one fire type. We'll take. Oh, this one's level 61, so maybe we'll take you instead. I was going to take two wood types. Whether this is a smart move or not, we'll see here. We'll see how the first uh, the temple goes, and then we'll make out. We'll take it from there for the second level. But yeah, we'll take Aroma as well with us, and here we go. Oh, you know what? I think we've got two of those Aromas now, so that was kind of unnecessary. But never mind, never mind. Wait a second, what's going on now? We just got here, damn it. Oh god. Oh, so this is the Amy they speak of. It's down to you. Everyone else's genius has been defeated. That's what call it Amy for now. All of them? By the human spec monkey? Hmm. This monkey is really that powerful? You must destroy monkey utterly. I never want to hear that name again. Consider it already done. Go focus on Zed City. Ha! Always so dependable. Amy, at least I can always count on you. Or can you, Dogma? Or can you? I oughta. Interesting. Guess it's time to see what this monkey is really made of. She seems like an interesting character. She can be very, very vicious and aggressive. You can just see it in her. Most of the other characters have been like really um, hilarious. They've had like a co good comedy to them, and they have been dangerous in a way. But they they're always on like the the comedy side. This one just seems pure evil. So we'll see how things go. So we're up against four, three water types. Good thing I took, I took um. What did I take? Yeah, good thing I <laughs> took two wood types as well because I was actually quite aware of. Of uh, water type monsters. Sorry for the pause, guys. I don't even know what I was thinking. But here we go. I thought we get to drop down with the green there and then kind of like work off of that. It worked out pretty well. We did rely on a bit of luck as well. But um, decent start, decent start. Two down, one to go. Oh, yeah, it's always this turtle thing which is actually really, really tough. Um, so I don't really expect to take him down. Hopefully this will be enough to take him down. We took no lights, we took no darks. Not really a fan of those. I mean, I love the element, I'm just not really a fan of the monsters I have of that element. So I decided to go with your typical three of water, fire, and wood. So uh, we're we'll trying your left here. Few, I thought a fire was going to drop down. It usually does tend to happen quite a lot. But yeah, smooth start so far, smooth start. Ah yes, so there is some light. The good thing is, everything is effective against light. Maybe not super effective, but it is effective. So, um, bam, bam. He okay, probably could have done better with that, but uh, it's not all that bad, I guess. All right, just the one down. It's not the greatest. Nah, I keep making these silly moves. I should have drained that fire background. But never mind. We made it. We made it. But yeah, these levels are starting to drag on and on and on. Let me get rid of some of these purple. Damn this purple. It makes me sick. We see too much of it, especially when I never have dark types with me. Alright, see so you lot again. Alright, cool. It's just always this one surviving. We, I don't think we've actually ever caught this one. I mean, he's good in terms of defense, but I don't really think he's that strong. But it, it, the game's it does that to you a lot. You find all these cool monsters, um, but they're never really an all-around. I mean, other than the ones we got at first, they, they're good all-around. Kind of like a Mario character that he's good all-around. But the stuff we found recently are usually good in one department. Which is kind of frustrating. I'm pretty sure there's going to be like something really special we can get our hands on uh, soon. But it's just that at the moment we're not really finding monsters we can work with. Alright, cool. Like the latest monster I'm using, I probably caught it like 
seven episodes ago. But anyway, time for another Dragon Stone. There's usually a certain amount of these um, stored in each of the dungeons. Clear seven of you and clear seven combos or more. Alright. Well, that's a combo of four, and that's the purples done. So, three more to go. Three more to go, and that's the three. We'll get rid of the horrible orbs such as Light and Dark. And we'll take our Dragon Stone and Reba Dirchi to Ulia. Ha ha ha. Oh my god, what the hell is this thing? He's big, he's big, alright. Ha. Huh. Okay. Oh my god. Call in two mines again. And do you know what? That actually worked out so, so well for us. Oh my god. That's my biggest combo in a while. It was only nine, but still. Nine! And there we go. Moving on to the boss. And let's see what we have in store for us this time. Oh, this thing's pretty. And a little one of those turtles, who would who would have thought it? Okay. Alright, that actually looked a lot better in my head. It wasn't really that effective in the end, but we did take down the turtle, which is not really our main priority right now. Probably the big guy, but still, taking down a turtle in one hit is kind of an impressive thing for me. So We'll go BAM. Oh god, we messed up that water combo. We'll bring it back. Oh no, we so close to bringing it back. Just a little bit slow on the, on the way back around. But then again, that was enough to take... Oh no, it wasn't enough. I was blinded by the glare. Alright, at least he didn't attack us. Uh, simple combo such as... Such as what, guys? Um, I'm asking you, I don't know. Uh, I mean, there's a few things to go with here. I just can't see it for some reason. Not sure why we were trying to go with light there, but uh, water should be enough, and it was. We got a chip there, which can hopefully help us evolve something, because it's been a while. A water dragon cutlass chip, and you can check to see what chips you need, but just getting hold of those chips is kind of a difficult part, because you don't really know where to get them from. Unless you go to that, like, dragon machine, you can get lucky there. It costs quite a bit of d so I'm not really sure. Oh god, boss already? The Everfrost lands, this is... New? <laughs> we never actually had a boss this early on. Maybe we have, I just don't remember. But yeah, here we go. I'm going to take Maxi just to be so fire in case um, it's going to be necessary because we've only got the one fire type with us, so we'll try and stay prepared here. <laughs> oh. Alright, cool. That's a okay first move. Mainly because of the Z orb. Alright, alright, alright. Alright, it's just a turtle left as usual. I'm sick of this turtle. He reminds me of someone, oh yeah, Squirtle, well, that's who he reminds me of. Not really sure why that hasn't came to mind until now. But yeah, he's definitely a Squirtle type monster. Alright, cool. Decent move, considering we didn't have much to work with there. I mean, the orbs were there, they just really, really weren't placed in the ideal place for someone like myself. But yeah, you know what, we're close to, du oh yeah, it's a no heart dungeon. Shoot, 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 you have it? No! No! We've literally got nothing to boost our health? Shoot! Dang it! Do you know what guys? We have to rely on a lot of... I'm not sure on what, but we have to rely on some good skill here. And a bit of luck, of course. Holy smokes, how can I forget about the heart thing? Do you know what? I didn't even remember it in the last dungeon where we somehow made it through. Unless we can go through 
if we can go straight on. And um, I don't know what this thing's going to do for us. It may just like help the pickup rate or refill our skill. I'm not sure what it's going to do, but we need something that can actually restore some of our health. Alright, sweet. Yes, and the Z-Orbs, that should take all three of them down. Especially considering it was a, it was a wood type Z-Orb. Oh shoot, 11 hit combo, that's definitely, that's now the biggest we've had in a while. Earlier it was 9, now it's 11, jeez. It's over the free, a free orb dungeon as well, so that's kind of a good thing for me. I feel good right now. Alright, but now what do we have here? Ah, uh, just an item drop rate doubles for a while. Um, there's literally no items you can find which will boost your health. So I guess we just gotta make it through here without taking a scratch. So we'll go with guard break here just to lower their defense. Uh, we do have the Z or by the way, so that shall come in handy. Alright, cool, we got a little lucky there as well. Um there should be enough to take down all three you would hope or would expect two Z orbs and a mystery egg. Nice. Damn, we probably got like two more battles to go through until we get to the boss, so tense times, tense times. Thankfully it's only these guys, they're not really that tough. Um Alright, cool. Please take them all down. Please, please, please. Oh, close, close, close. Four down, one to go. Oh, we did. Oh, God, that was actually quite a big hit. Seriously, we got nothing that can boost us? We actually don't. Well, if we can. If, I mean, we've got the skills to get us through this. We've got the skills, guys, and we have to like go all out with our skill moves. Probably why this is only two levels inside this dungeon, because it's kind of very punchy. We leveled up also, which... Oh, leveling up doesn't even recover any health. Uh, I was about to say leveling up is going to help us get a bit of health back, but nothing. Shoot. But yeah, last battle until that boss. I may go... Alright, I'll go with a guard break. If we don't manage to kill it here, then I may just go with a burning breath. But we'll see what we can do from here all right we may need something a little better there certainly most certainly no burning breath is not even available no we took the wrong dragon uh, Mega Smash is going to have to do it for us. Hopefully it takes down this big beast. Dang. This is heartbreaking stuff, guys. Heartbreaking stuff. Alright, you know what? I'm super lost on what to do. Alright, let's see what this does for us. It's going to take down at least one of them. Alright, just this guy is left. Grudge, what's Grudge? Alright, Grudge was bad news. That was bad news. Um, I mean, we're not in like the worst of situations here. It could be better, of course. Could be worse. But yeah, the boss is amongst us. We're, we're like limited, super limited on health. Just under 2,000. Oh, and here we go. Oh, I'm dreading this. I'm super dreading this. Well, fancy meeting you two here. Thank you, Sarah. Please heal us. Please. I'll do anything. Hello, Syrup. That was a weird. That was weird. All three of you, stay where you are. Huh? Who are you? I'm the one asking the questions here. Vasu, now tell me who you fr what you three are. Wait, what? We're humans. Yami? Sarah? What? I did say she was going to be a very aggressive girl, and she definitely is. But these two know each other? Yami, how long has it been? And to bump into your, to you here? Wait, to bump into your here? Uh, of all places, to you here, I think. But yeah, five years, I think. 
Oh, where are my manners? Let me introduce you to my friends. Wait, what is going on here? Mrs. Monkey and that syrup. Hmm. Amy is a friend from way back, Monkey. Way, way back. When everyone called her Yami. Hi. We'll just call her Yami from now instead of Amy, whatever it was. Maybe it was Ayami? Maybe? Ayami? I don't know. But sorry, I'm not a child anymore. It's been years. I've changed. For the worst. As for these two, I know all about them. You cut down my comrades. They did what? To whom? And... And just who are these? You these days? The Gold Cavalier. No, are you in Paradox? You can't be. The Yami I remember would never. The Yami you remember is long gone. But... Stand aside, Sarah. My business is with Monkey. Prepare yourself, Monkey. We've got to battle her. Monkey, we have no choice. No choice but to lose against my monster's vengeance will be mine! Alright. Well, remember guys, we're limited on health here. Hopefully it's just a one monster. Nope, it's... It's three of them. Three light types, which is kind of weird. It does match your hair, but yeah. Um, three light types. Now, they're all going to attack in... Well, two of them are going to attack in one turn, so... We'll guard break. We'll guard break for now. We can't really... Um, afford to be hit by any of them. So... Let me see what this one does. Change wood orbs into water ones. Uh, I don't know about this. Alright, we'll see what this does. Oh my god! Alright, cool. It's a stat boost. It's a stat boost. Oh shoot, that was close. The good thing that we've got like one chance to... Oh, it's just too much to ask for. What's Dragon's Law? All of your monsters attack our group attacks for four turns. And that could come in handy. We're gonna have to go with it, guys. Dragon's Law. I've never, I've never actually fully understood this move, but hopefully it pays off here. Alright, I need to plan out this move, seriously. Oh yes, a Z orb. Sweet, sweet. Just what we needed. All right, cool. Super lucky there. Super lucky. And there we go. Yes. Oh my god, how did we survive that one? Oh my god, 90 health points left. Jeez. That's 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 crazy. Oh my god, we actually made it. I am over the moon. Now I see. No wonder you beat the others. Ingenious. Yami, please. You can't just be one of them. I'm the best of the best. And yet your friend here gave me a good fight. I'd hardly call it defeat though, this was more of an introduction, but next time I'll introduce you to my true powers, you won't stand a chance. Oh dear. Yami, wh why? Chin up Sarah, it's gonna be alright. Sarah, Sarah, Sarah. What the hell is she doing out here anyway? We haven't seen her in a while. But there we go guys, we have moved on to the second dungeon of the fifth continent. It was a very eventful one, I really enjoyed that considering how Hence it was, but yeah, that was a lot of fun. Damn, we definitely need to work on some of our monsters now, so I probably will spend a bit of time doing that, but I can't believe that Sarah's childhood friend is Paradox's strongest soldier. I'm sorry, Sarah. Facing a friend under such circumstances, you're, ex you're excused from this mission if you wish. Captain, I appreciate your consideration, but I won't run away from this. I expected as much. Very well, Sarah. Rest assured, we are here to support you to the best of our abilities. Not sure why, why I went so dramatic there, but how about some pork scratchings? She doesn't want your stupid scratchings. Um, <clears throat> Nick, I believe I gave you another mission. Oh, you're right. I'm out of here. Ah, oh, that Nick. Pork scratchings. That boy's short on good sense. Nick's got a good heart, though. In his own way. He always forgets I'm a vegetarian. So where are we off to next, mateys? 
Syrup, I like you and Monkey to head for the Glow Moss Cave. And you, Sarah, head over to the Caracal Mountains. Understood. Let's get cracking, Monkey. Alright, guys and girls, that's going to be all for now, as usual. 25 minutes we got through. That's actually kind of a long time, because it was only two dungeons, uh, two levels. But yeah, very eventful. Hopefully you did enjoy this one. If you did, you guys know what to do. Hit that like button, because it really does help. And I hope to see you all in the next video. See ya.